Let's simply whip it up. We're gonna make peanut brittle. This is the recipe I was telling you guys. I suck at making it. I called her, I'm like, come down, see what I'm doing. I don't know, it's her magic touch. So, mom's peanut brittle. What are we doing, mom? The ingredients in the pan, bring them to a boil. Okay, so what ingredients are we putting? We're gonna do one pan at a time. It's never double batch it, she said. Just do one batch at a time. So turn it on low. One cup of corn syrup. Half a cup of water. Two cups of sugar. Stir it. Stir that. Turn your heat up to about medium. Medium heat. <laughs> look what look what I did. And this is my kitchen. I have the back burner on. <laughs> Whoops. So it's one of those fun days. Stir it up. How long do I stir this? Dissolve the sugar and bring it to a rolling boil. We'll see if I mess it up today. Can you stop stirring or you gotta continuously stir? You can go back and stir now and then. When you're waiting on this to come to a boil, you can butter your cookie sheets. Okay, so she said to go ahead and butter your cookie sheet. She, she said, use real butter when you do it. And she said, don't go all the way to the edges because the peanut butter, when you pour it on here, it will stop where the butter's at. Rub it all over. It's a magic, so don't stick to the cookie sheet. Break right off. Just a slow process, but you don't want to rush it. Maybe that's my problem. My patience. Can't rush it. All right, so it's rolling, boiling. So now we're gonna add the Spanish raw peanuts. Three cups, Spanish raw peanuts. Stir them. The recipe calls for two cups, but I like the peanuts in it, so I add extra. Now we cook this and stir it off until it comes amber colored. Do I continuously stir this? No, you don't. Now I'm smelling it. I'm smelling those peanuts cooking. Okay, so does that mean that we're ready to add the rest of the stuff? The peanuts are amber. Give it just a couple more seconds. Okay, now I'm saying shut the burner off and add your butter. Two tablespoons of butter. And then I add the vanilla. Two teaspoons of vanilla. She's a smoking. And when you add the baking soda, it's gonna start foaming and rise up all over. How many baking sodas? Three. This is when you have your pot holders ready, stir that up real good off the edges and everything. Once that butter's dissolved in there, you wanna dump it on your cookie sheet. Looks good to me. I leave it set until it gets cool. And once it cools completely, you break it apart and you got your peanut brittle. So she puts it in her little mudroom on benches and it lets it all sit out there to get cooled. All tasted, no waste. Now mom's putting me to the test. She's making me make my own batch now to see if I can actually know what I'm doing since we just made the video. And so we'll see how mine turns out. 